Um, only please pull down your mask if you have to ask a question because then it will carry to um, Dr. Jay's side of the room. Okay. Right. So, I need to connect to teams. Um, is this a split double? We've got break in between. Wonderful. Okay. Okay, so the only people that should be there are Sean Mahir, Rishi, and Ashley. No one else, please. You start to not yet today? Really? That's what I'm saying. Does not yet today mean he's absent? I want to know why. Alright, please join it. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to start recording uh, for the people at home, even if they haven't arrived. Can't hold that. And then I will share the screen and let's pray this works. Okay. Include audio. Oh, Garrett, that's all thing is in. Okay. Time to just tell me if you can hear the sound. All right. When it starts to load. The front line is, as you can see here, it's to illuminate sort of his facial expressions, the sense of determination, almost like danger. So, he is almost trying to convince the king. So could you also say that because he's actually like highlighting actual truths that are facing the world today, so he's also like the front line is to show that he's also highlighting the truth. Very good. I like that as well. Excellent point. Excellent point. Yes, so he's, he's, he's almost in a sense the bringer of truths from the darkness of the reality. Is that what you're trying to say? Yes, sir. Last time we've got this. So that was known as, as a hybrid lesson. Um, so a hybrid lesson basically means that you have to work with two different systems. So you've got to work with the children who are in the, in the venue at the school. And this is our small auditorium. But then you've also got children with comorbidities and as you know the whole regulation, so they have to be at home. The problem with this lesson is because it's film study, um, two systems are kind of um, interfering with each other. So in other words, if the children can hear the sound through the speakers um, behind you, then the children can't hear the sound at home. But they can hear my analysis. Every single lesson is recorded. Um, that's, that's also to me is, is both positive and negative because if it is recorded that doesn't mean that they actually actually have to be here at you know 12.30 until half past two whatever the case may be um, but then the onus is on them and that's where the issue is to go and watch that recording and catch up on the notes and we have no we have how do you say it we, we have no sort of um, register or, or kind of uh, feedback that they're actually doing it. Because they can say they have. And <laughs> okay. Um, so the second one is fine. Mm -hmm. Okay. So this is Bar, this is Bar Lili, this is Paolo, you remember, and it. And this is the Concord of this Paolo, you still remember. It. Then we said here, yeah, in issues will be adjective, it will be into two. You remember, and it. We said it is, is Paulo and? Paulo. Is it? Bali. Mm. Is Bali. So I'm trying to this for Papa is Bali here. But again, I always say this. In issues, you need a multiple pixels. Who is a constructor? I'm a complex. Is my color clear? And then, Ulu, get a madam. And then the last one, Tatabat, Uam. Okay, when you see this, what comes to your mind? Okay. Last year, so I'm going to see here, I'm a 
adjective, relative adjective. Remember, we said it is relative adjective, I mean. And that niggas are not examples of God. Can you remember the examples of this value? Give me the basics of this value. Just few that you can remember. Abantu. Hmm? Abantu. No, adjectives. Okay. Not now. Ah? Uh, Ban. Okay. Yebo. Ado. I am so as Is this one better? I don't think you can see it on the camera. Huh? I don't think you can see it on the camera. The colors is quite clearly. Right. That's a great for both. Huh? That's a great for both. Yes, it works for both. Okay. Okay. So, in the as of that, what is it something edible or is it something audible? Mm. <laughs> before. <laughs> in now, before. I need. You know the only thing of the next one? Examples. So. And then we will we'll let you take, take the reins of it. Okay, right, let's put that example up on the board, or the question up on the board. You give it a shot. I want you all to just to mount it for yourself and then rank yourself against what, what your perception was, okay? So there's a toy car that's being pushed. The first half, of course, is an acceleration, as you can see over here. The second half is that the car is let go and it slows down. And it's slowing down under the influence of? <coughs> under the influence of? Friction. Friction. Friction, absolutely, because there's nothing else acting on it. All right? Now you're given the following. That the car, in 17.5 seconds, travels 29.8 meters. All right. So the first half of the question is expected definitions, concepts. We're okay with that. The next half, have a look and see if you can answer it, right? I'm going to leave you to run solo with this, see how you do. I want you just to answer for me up until 2.1.3. Okay. All right, so if you are on Teams, you can see the screen as well now. Hi, Sean. Can you see the screen? Yes. Okay, we, we're trying questions 2.1.1 <coughs> up until 2.1.3. Okay. So this is in our tablets, right? Yeah, I, I did push it to your tablet as well. Okay. Cool. Alright, so we're going to check back right now, so I need you to do this as quickly as you can, okay? Just to rank yourself for the section, okay? Just so you can have a have an idea of how well you are, or how how much you understand, and then how much you need to do to be able to close the gaps, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Okay. No worries. Is this car on a slope or is it just being pushed? No, it's, you can assume that it's on a, it's on a, on a flat horizontal surface. Oh, right, okay. Okay. So, sir? Mm hmm.
There's always room for improvement. I think um, we could have added, um, we could have added some uh, practical demonstrations to make the, the lesson more enriched, and we could have also, um, you know, just, you know, come back and done another cycle of retesting just to make the students more aware and more master, masterful. Um, but we do have a hybrid teaching system where learners are online and seeing exactly what is on the board that the students are seeing in the classroom. So we're having to tandem between speaking to the students online and the students who are in, in the class, present in the class as well. I think it is a bit more strenuous, um, but face-to-face -face teaching is the first it's the first uh, route of call because you you miss you miss so many social clues when you just yeah. speaking to uh, to a, a screen, and you can see if kids get it or not.